hello friends so in this video we will talk about email phishing so uh, let's say uh, you are an individual person and someone with uh, with the genuine let's say uh, microsoft.com let's say right send you a mail regarding this one and here here i have taken the example of comcast.net so let's let's take this example and just analyze these things that what is going on here so you got a mail uh, with this comcast.net and you can see it is genuine the sender is looks like genuine right whenever you will search this search this it will show you genuine email right but here check the this email the email which is looking uh, at the in this mail is different but the actual url is different it is uh, redirecting to some some other things if you can see so here you just get to know that it's a phishing mail which is redirecting to others some other websites and maybe it will ask for the credentials it maybe it will ask for uh, your david card or david card maybe i guess david card yes here it is written so after verifying your david card transaction we will take necessary steps to protect your account from fraud right so it's already a fraud correct it, it, they are they are not taking your things for the for the good thing but they are already doing a fraud because this this url is something different and you can't uh, can't believe on this on this email so why why this uh, sender domain has been definitely it has been spoofed but how it was spoofed on that we will talk later that uh, what is the concept behind this that even a genuine website is uh, spoofed so that's that's how email phishing works guys and uh, apart from this uh, we are not talking about only this mail uh, you can also get many mails uh, from different different things right right different different domains and in those uh, there will be some attachment and once you will uh, click on that attachment then the malware will be downloading and once that malware will download that will call or that will drop some other malware so there will be a command and control for the attacker which is going to be a very uh, uh, big thing because an attacker once uh, having the command and control of your system and he can do each and everything you can't imagine about that so uh, what email with the help of email phishing attackers can uh, steal your data can inject malware can drop uh, drop malwares as as i said i hope uh, i'm very clear with that email phishing and uh, that's that's the end of all types of phishing and yeah definitely there is also many uh, many types of phishing but if i will uh, cover those it will take lot of time so i i'm the the motto of uh, giving these five phishing uh, just a demo uh, because just to just to know that that how it is working and what is the background concept of these things now we will show you uh, next thing in the next video so till then bye bye take care